When anyone hears the phrase missing in the line of duty, it's easy to immediately fear the worst. Search and rescue dog Zach has worked tirelessly for years trying to find others, but now everyone's looking for him. Animal rescue specialist Buster Brown has been called out to help find search dog Zach. He's disappeared searching for a missing person. His owner and handler, Kevin Saunders, is part of the Lowland search and rescue team. He and Zach have saved many lives together, but tonight things have taken an unexpected turn. A boy dog. How old did you say he was? Three and a half. Three and a half. And you've worked him for? Uh, since he's born. Nice. Yeah, so so well used to this sort of environment and terrain, so it's unu totally unusual out of character. He's got, he's got to be caught or yeah. stuck somewhere or injured. Kevin is bereft. Zach is a much loved family dog as well as a highly trained member of the search team. He's been missing now for nearly four hours. We're initially searching up here, yeah. but there is a drop, you know, there's quite a drop there. And then the tunnels, well, the only drop is the tunnels, you know, you drop yeah. down. They're in an area known as the Ramparts near Portsmouth. Basically a very high uh, mud mound, about 30 to 40 feet high, into which has been built um, old military defences. And the dog was at the top of these when it was doing its search and it then disappeared. Now the, the fear is it's fallen down into one of the tunnels. Zach could be lying injured in one of these tunnels, unable even to bark to get attention. The team that earlier was searching for a missing girl is now trying to find Zach. But even the police helicopter with its infrared camera has failed to detect anything. It looks like it's going to be a very long night. But suddenly he's appeared and is reunited with an overjoyed Kevin. He's carefully checked over, but Zach seems none the worse for his experience. Kevin calls the rest of the team with the good news. He's, he's fine, he's not scared, he's chilled, he's nice and relaxed. Oh, it's the best possible ending. Well, I'm happy to say Zach and Kev are with us now. Uh, what happened, do you think? I don't think we'll ever know. Uh, Zach uh, obviously... He hasn't told had... you? No, no, he hasn't <laughs> told us. Uh, Zach obviously went off somewhere. Uh, we believe he got caught because of the, the branch that came through his collar when we found him. Um, but we'll never know for sure. All right, well, it's good that he's back. I mean, how you've had him, what, since he was a little pup? Yeah. You do I... this voluntarily, right? Indeed, yeah. All the uh, fuel costs and, and, and training costs are our own. Um, we uh, we do it completely voluntary. We fundraise for for team uh, bits, um, but yeah, everything else is is. So this down is to your your little doggy, really. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so how do you train a dog it's to do a, the things he does? It's just a big game of um, hide and seek, really. Uh, it takes uh, uh, about a year to to get up to a standard where they can go for assessment. Uh, it starts with me running away, and then we change me for someone else. And then we just slowly put in the various stages needed for him to find someone, tell us he's found someone, and then take us back to him. And he gets rewarded for this, does he? Yeah, he does. Yeah, What's he, he get? He gets his purple toy. Uh, right. His favourite toy in the whole world is his little purple toy. You're easily pleased, aren't you, doggy? Now, I've seen it on the telly. You give him a cloth of someone, you know, you get a scent there. Is that how you do it? That's mainly TV. Right, no, okay. no, in real life, he just looks for any human scent in an area. It's called air scenting. Right, and he goes off, and then you sort of walk towards him, and then what happens? He'll, uh, once he's found someone, he'll come back and alert me to the fact he's found someone. Zach, uh, his alert is he'll come back and sit in front of me. Yeah. I'll then give him the show me command, and he'll take me into that missing person. Brilliant. OK, well, we're going to have a real, real rescue on telly now. Uh, we've sent someone out into the was a mate of yours, right? Zach, I promise you, has not seen where he is. And we'll do it for real, shall we? Yeah. OK, send him off then. Ready? 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 We find! So how many rescues has he been involved in? Good boy, we find! Uh, last year uh, alone, we done. Uh, we have responded to 29. 29? Orders. Yeah, throughout the south coast. Right, so he's running around. He's saying, Dad, I'm not sure that I found anything yet. I think he's just picked up on something. Has he? Show me then! OK. Show me then what you got! 
Oh, I can see somebody. Show me then. And there he is. Oh, he's a good boy. Oh, you got him. <laughs> good lad. He's a good, good lad. Boy, are you there? Dan, are you all right there? I am now. Thank you very much for finding That's me. That's all right, mate. Well done. And well done, Zach. He's a good boy, eh? He's a good boy, eh?